Granted, I'm on a side. Thanks, Aaron. <sighs> Yes, it is. Hey guys, Crew Blonde Wave, I'm Eric. Rick! And just like the island, sometimes storms just magically pop up. It is storming outside, so if you guys hear any thunder or anything like that, it's not you, it's me. Oh, it's us. Yeah. That'd be fun. Well, that would be fun, because technically our stuff would still keep recording. Yeah. But everything else would go away. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, last time on the island, on Lost. Rose and Bernard, yeah. backstory. Great backstory. Rose feeling like like whatever that sickness that was in her is gone. It's been healed. Yep. John understands. John does and understand. And also done with the hatch, so he can go find other hatches. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't know all that stuff is crazy. Who Apparently. Knows? And yeah. then, Michael. Michael is back. Michael is back. So. Winded. What has uh, Michael seen or heard or discovered? Not a damn thing. Damn it. And they're animals. With us just watching oh, Fast and Furious, do you feel like you know her more? I feel like I'm wondering when they're going to get a car. She's out of her element. True. I'll never give you Walt. Michael. Michael. Did they trade Michael instead of Walt? Michael. <laughs> okay. I was like, is that a gun? Is he going to shoot him? You didn't just push him out into the jungle, Jack. He's alone. You're never alone. Don't leave that fire burning. God damn it, Eric. She, Kate's going back to do it. You didn't you see? Fires. She bent out of frame. She went to take fire with her. This makes me think of GTA. Steal that car, drive it off the roof, blow it up, steal another car. What? Is this the day after she killed what someone? Mm-hmm. You don't know that. All night? Mm-hmm. You don't know anything? Yeah. What'd you watch? What's always on? TV land. There you go. Bonanza. Who's gonna lie about Bonanza? No one. Any idea who did it? Yeah, Anna. You did. What? This man confesses to shooting you in cold blood, and you refuse to ID him, so we had to cut him loose. A week later, he shows up with five bullets in his chest because someone shot him in cold blood. You don't want my help. You're going to have to get it from somewhere else. I have to get police officer, Anna. my help from somewhere else? I quit. It's the best outcome. She really should have demanded the gun of the bat. <laughs> and she can't prove is what she's saying. Like, they'll go to trial and it'll be a dead end. How long are you going to keep up this hunger strike, Henry? You think Hurley's waiting outside for the leftovers? If you're going to say something, you're going to have to speak up. The Jake the Snake move. Yep. Guess he decided to start talking, huh? <laughs> That's just the oldest trick in the, in the book, right? Yes. Yeah. Huh? And I kick you like, speak louder! <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens. That's what you do. All right, I guess you don't want to say anything. Leave. Yeah, right? No more papaya. Take it all. You have to listen to her lead it. Every TSA agent I've ever met looked exactly with that expression. Every one. Long day, huh? Hey. He gets around. I don't believe that parents and their kids should work together. Too many issues. Yeah, like a murderer. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Both of them. So where are you headed? What I'm doing down there could be a little dangerous, and I need someone to protect me, a bodyguard. It's perfect for someone who... Dangerous. Being Getting cop. drunk? You look like a Tom. Tom. What an excellent name. And you should be a... Sarah. Sarah. Jack's wife's yeah, name? Yeah, it's Jack's wife's name. We know he got drunk there, but we're not really sure why he's there, right? To get drunk. Because, as you do, if you want to get drunk, you have to go to Australia. Yep. You have the beers with the kangaroos on them. <laughs> Don't do anything stupid. Has anyone ever listened to that ever? Ever. In the history of the world and or cinema. George Washington. What? He crossed the That was river stupid. On Christmas. They won. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes stupid works out. <laughs> if you've come to apologize, I forgive you for hitting me with your crutch. It's one of my favorite weapons, the crutch. Yeah, it's very poetic. Don't kill me because I failed, John. I failed my mission. Is it Mr. Echo? 
She's gonna try to get a gun. That's how she solves all her problems. It's worked out so far. With only a couple pieces of collateral damage. How about you just give me a gun? Here's another idea. Scram. Scram. <laughs> I haven't told someone to scram in a long time. It's a hell of a hotel room. Yeah, it is. Doctor yep. can afford it. Anytime you know that we're in Sydney, they just show that opera house. <laughs> How else would you know? I mean, they could just leave everything upside down. Stay in the car. Should I keep the meter running? Thank God he got a driver. Hmm. This isn't the farmhouse Kate's at. Dude, nice hole. What is it, Daddy? What is it, Harley? <laughs> Only gotten static. Here's the thing. Even that would be good. Because then Libby would be like, it's a thought that counts. <laughs> so it worked? <laughs> Why don't you give me that one right there? I ain't gonna give me you nothing. What you gonna do now, muchacha? Don't fall for it. You have two people this good looking in the jungle wrestling. This is what happens. But the poison ivy, Eric. Oh, yeah, you're goddamn right. <laughs> Make love in the water. <laughs> hey, I'm walking here. <laughs> you tell anyone about this, and I'll kill you. Get that takes cuddling off the table. <laughs> Lot of for a picnic. This isn't what it looks like. And what does it look like? A raid. Do you, you want to go? Where to? Can that part still be a surprise? <laughs> oh, you ever heard of the band Static? <laughs> Thrash metal. I think he's waking up. He was out for so long. What? Yeah. I found them. Not they found me. We are gonna get my boy back. We can take him. You were right. Right about what? <laughs> about Henry. I don't like how you did it, but I shouldn't have gotten in your way. Didn't even hear about the choking. Harley, this is our beach. There's Jim. <laughs> 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 Give me the blanks. Blankets? <laughs> okay, I tell you what. I will handle the blankets. You just track down Rose and Bernard. I saw them pull wine from the pallet. Okay? Maybe if I get drunk enough, I'll remember where I know you from. That's how drinking works, right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jen's the best. <laughs> he does have the best smile on the island. I got like 10 pages left. Hey! Wanna figure it out? No! So mean! Such a dick! Why? You burned the ending of my book, and now you Where are they, James? You too, Brutus? Just take us to the guns. <laughs> take us to the guns. Now. <laughs> oh, bitch. You know, I immediately know she took that. Come on! Come on there we go. Why would she need a gun? Why, you think? Oh, he doesn't know. He should know. <clears throat> he doesn't know. I should have said something. What? Pick it up. What was that, a knife? Man, wasted rope. I want you to listen to me, okay? Because I'm asking you a favor. I think Tom's gonna answer. Where is everybody? What you said got them worked up. They went to get all the guns back from Sawyer. Sawyer? <laughs> we caught one of them. The others. He's locked up in there. No. Oh. Michael might do it. I couldn't do it. I couldn't even kill him. Then let me do it. I'll do it. Give me the gun. I'll kill him. I don't think he's one of the good ones. What's the combination? 18 right, one left, 31 right. 
You want me to write it down? I'm writing it down. I'm sorry. What? Don't kill Lana. <laughs> oh, Michael. Michael? <laughs> oh, he's going to try to trade Henry for Walt. <laughs> so long. This episode was called Two for the Road. Two for the Road. Okay. Anna and Lily, I guess? Libby. Libby. Write that down so you finally remember her name. Well, I have to assume it's for some sort of trade. I don't think Michael killed himself. I think he shot himself to make it look like Henry shot him and escaped. Yeah. It's kind of my prevailing theory right now. And that's some sort of trade for Walt, but I don't know. Maybe he was indoctrinated and. I mean, he told to them what it. he saw. Yeah. Do you trust him? I don't think. Well, what he said doesn't make sense. He found one in the woods. I don't think there is. He tracked it back to their village. Well, he, he like found one at the beach. Yeah. And yeah, he tracked to the village where it was old people and women, two guards, two guns. So from what we've seen, I don't think Michael has the ability to s stealthily follow one of them. Yeah. They all seem to have, be almost like superhuman in their strength and stealth skills. Like Locke couldn't track them whenever they had come into the camp at one point. Yeah, and they were just like killing people on the beach. Mm -hmm. So like his story doesn't make a lot of sense. But I don't know the motive of why he's lying. Is it because he's on their side now? Or is it he made a deal with them? Yeah. And is therefore on their side now? Like, why kill Anna? I mean, he needed the vault, so he needed Henry out for some reason. But Henry seemed to think that he was dead anyway because he failed. So why is it so important that like, why would the others even want Henry mm -hmm. at this point? He also didn't seem too awful phased. Like, you hear gunshots out there, and I'm sorry, you know, that kind of oh, stuff. Henry? And Henry's kind of sitting there like, <laughs> and he just wake, gets up, you know? I don't know. I feel like he was pretty accepting yeah. of his fate, True. whatever it was going to be yeah. anyway. I don't think Libby's going on that picnic. She was there for wine? She was there for uh, blankets. She was holding blankets in her hands. Okay. Hurley was getting the wine. Yeah. Hurley was getting the drinks. She was getting the blankets. Mm. They did the laundry at the hatch. Wrong place, wrong time. This means that the only people left from the other side are Bernard and Echo, right? Yes. Assuming they both die. Uh, <clears throat> yeah. Which we don't know for sure, but sure doesn't seem good. The one, like, uh, Marshall we had that was shot did not survive. He wasn't even shot, was he? He's, his leg was broken? The Marshall? Yeah, he was, well, he had some shrapnel in his shrapnel, abdomen. that was it. But then also, Sawyer shot him. Yeah. And he didn't die. <laughs> he did not. He did not survive. Yeah. He was already in poor shape before. But yeah. I don't expect anyone to live here except maybe Michael. Yeah. Like, if you're going to kill yourself, that's not where you would shoot yourself. Sure. It kind of cuts, like, when he's, like... Yeah. You know? So... Like it's if not he was like, going to do it, you would... Yeah, if you wanted the audience to think, oh, he's dead, you would have him put it to his head. Yeah. So I imagine he's going to survive. Mm -hmm. It's hard to know now, but... I, mean, I, I can't blame him. I can understand why he would kill Anna to save his son. Mm -hmm. If that was what was going to happen. How desperate is he? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we don't know. We just have his word, but we don't know what happened over there. Yeah, we don't know. How far would he be willing to go? Uh, I figured that the others released him, and that he was like the trade, but... And you know, it, it seems like case. he purposely killed Anna. Like, well, I'm sorry. You know, he says I'm sorry. Yeah. Like, he doesn't want to do this, but he does it. 
But Libby seemed like a an accident. real big accident. Yeah, like he had to kill Anna because Anna would never let him take Henry. Yeah. And that seemed like his plan. Or to let Henry go and mm-hmm. Michael can be wounded. Although, why not just go with Henry if that's the case? I'm not really sure. I guess they would then suspect Michael mm-hmm. as well. Maybe. Wouldn't let him back in, maybe. Yeah. If he even wants back in. I don't know. I'm very confused. I know. <laughs> in season two, I, I think that you've let it be known, and others have felt this way too. Anna is not necessarily our favorite character. But, you know, here when she wants to kill Henry and can't, you know, like the person that she killed before, she had killed Shannon accidentally. Right. You know, but it's not like she meant to. She did kill Goodwin also accidentally. Didn't feel like she meant to. Like, in that last scene when she calls her mom and says she wants, wants to come home, you can tell, you know, she feels like she's made a mistake. You know, she's not a good cop, but there's part of me that can be like, look, that guy shot you, you lost your baby, fuck him, you know? But that's a, it's a, it's a part of me that's not the one that's making decisions, <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah. So, like, I can feel for her, but I don't know. And that scene when she's talking to her mom in the airport knowing that she's not going to make it and that mom's just going to be waiting there, you know. It's sad to see. Which would have happened anyway because the plane crashes. Yeah, exactly. But yeah, now she's never going to see her, mm-hmm. probably. I can't say I'm going to miss Anna. Sure. But... Do we miss Libby? I don't know. It's real, real weird for Libby to die here. Yeah. Because it seemed like they seeded... A relationship with her early. Well, not just Before. that, but... Mystery. Like a mystery of her being in the mental institution mm-hmm. and keeping that a secret. Yeah. For some reason, like that was going to lead somewhere. Sure. I wonder if Hurley will ever realize it, or I mean, it's possible she doesn't die. Uh, if they were just blankets, it's not, not going to give her much protection. At first, I wasn't sure what it was, mm-hmm. what she was holding, but maybe she survives. I don't know. I Kef- mean, Kefla the, blanket. Well, the island it heals, right? Yeah, it does. There's healing spots there on the is. island. We've had people die, but yes, you can heal. There could be Maybe you have to be one of the good ones to heal. Maybe. Good one thought Anna was one of the good ones. He was trying to convince that you were worthy, says Henry. Yeah. And he tells John, you're one of the good ones. Yeah, I came here for you. That was his mission. Gonna, he was going to kill Anna. Yeah. You know? Sure. And his mission was here for John. To take John. And he didn't cave in John's head when he was trapped because you were one of the good ones. Yep. I don't know what that means. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm afraid John would switch to the other side. But maybe the other side is the right side. For we all don't I know mean. much about the other side. No idea. Just what we've been told, but it's by someone who we clearly can't trust. Mm-hmm. Other side. I'm glad we say it that way. We also had in the flashback, you know, her going to Australia, meeting Christian Shepherd. Mm-hmm. And what all we learn about him over there? He's got a daughter. Yeah. Which means Jack has a sister, at least a half sister. We've seen Jack's mother before. We have. That was not Jack's mother. No. Should I recognize her? I don't believe so. Okay. Because I did not. Yeah. No, I don't think so. It wasn't Kate's mom. <laughs> it wasn't Kate's mom. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no. I want to see. I want to see my daughter. Like I pay for this house. He I pay he, for this mortgage. He pays for the mortgage, so it's yeah. so. Like, he's been funding them. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, I wonder if um, it's someone on the island. Or, uh, yeah, if it's... Like, like in the group? Yeah. Hmm. Like if it's Libby or... Sure. Yeah. It's not Libby. I hope not, too. Yeah. But Jack has a sister out there somewhere. Yeah. And Her the only way I can see it coming back is if she's on the island. Yeah. Because Anna's not going to say anything now if she's dead. So how else does that story come back if... She's not on the island. Maybe she's one of the others. Mother had an Australian accent. Maybe. What's his name? See you in another life, brother. Desmond. Desmond was the sister. Oh, okay. (laughs) And brother was literal. Brother's literal. (laughs) I don't know how he identifies. You don't know? Can't ask him. He's not here. Can't. He's somewhere, though. He is somewhere. Damn you, Michael. Michael said that he didn't see anything like a boat, though we know the others do have a boat. True. And fake beards. And fake beards. Didn't say anything about that. Kate didn't really say anything about that. And a hatch. They have a hatch. Which would make sense. And uh, canvas tents and teepees. Mm -hmm. Which he said, they're worse off than us. But that seems like an improvement over what most of them have to sleep under. Yeah. 
So. Well, they do have less guns, apparently. Apparently. Uh, less able-bodied men. I'm trying to remember when they were in the forest and they had Kate mm-hmm. kidnapped. Like, yep. how many guns did they have? Because they had... I can't even remember how many guns they had on the boat when they took them over. They had at least one. At least one. Sawyer was Sawyer shot. got shot. We saw Mr. Friendly. He didn't have a weapon. And then uh, we also saw all the torches in the like in the jungle. Yeah. But he did ask them to give them their weapons, which were at least two. Right? True. Like, it would have been did locks and jacks. So they have at least two more mm-hmm. in addition to the one they had on the boat. Yeah. So a minimum of three. Yeah. Saw no kids. At least that's what he said. He thinks that they're in the hatch, yeah. along with Walt. Mm-hmm. You know that? Hmm. I mean, they didn't make it to the beach. But the idea of going to that beach is cursed. The but, sex beach. Yes. It is. The last person that was taken there was killed. It's starting to turn into a horror movie. You shouldn't go to that beach. If you are getting laid or thinking about getting laid, you die. Anna. Anna. Sharon. Shannon. Shannon. And and Libby. Libby. Yeah, they did. So Sawyer is he? Uh, he got he had sex he first did. time in a long time. He's dead on the inside. I'm sure Rose and Bernard have sex. Jen definitely had sex. That's true. Nothing better happen to Jen. Dude, More whenever sex. he thumb, <laughs> like gives a thumbs up for for uh, Hurley, I love that moment. It's bittersweet for me because I know it's not gonna nothing's gonna happen. Sure. But he just like. <laughs> Baby daddy. Yeah, and I love yeah, <laughs> daddy. <laughs> and I love the moment too when she comes out. It's like this is our beach. It's like what? No, it's not. Yes, it is. There's Jen. <laughs> He's clearly standing in front of me. <laughs> it's such a funny moment. Oh man, I love it. Uh, I've been there. Yeah, I imagine you have. It, it does seem strange to me that Sawyer didn't immediately check for his gun. Yeah. <laughs> Immediately. He's probably, I mean, he's just been blue balling the whole island, you know? Something's like, ah. You know how sometimes it happens. You wake up and you're like, how the fuck did I get here? You know? <laughs> she had her shirt off. He still had his pants on. Yeah. There's some comedian that described, like, if, look, oh. if, if you're horny and stuff's happening, sometimes it's like you're in the back of the bus and someone else is driving and you're just like, like where are we going? <laughs> you know? It's like the Seinfeld chess match of the penis versus the brain. It is. It is. So, yeah, they did have sex, and then, yeah. Yeah. No, it's a curse. Mm-hmm. Chase Voorhees is going to come out of that forest and start... Probably. They could use the machete. They could. I don't think we have anything else. I mean, Michael did say there was 22 of them he had counted. Mm-hmm. We also did see, like, you know, Loss always likes to do this with its flashbacks. Like, you know, she drops Christian off at the bar... That bar we see where Sawyer and Christian will meet, you yeah. know? But it's, just like that kind of opening up into Sawyer's like, son of a bitch, you know? <laughs> it's always funny. Child old man. Yeah. We do get, like, you know, Christian Shepard, you know, you would think, oh, him and Sawyer had that moment, but he had a much bigger relationship with Anna Lucia, you know? And then I also like, too, that Jack is talking about his father and how, like, he's dead and I don't get a chance to talk to him anymore or whatever. I gotta bury him and be done with this. Right. Anna Lucia, who has met Jack before, and Christian Shepard separately, but doesn't recognize Jack from behind, hears that, doesn't know that he's talking about the person that she was just with who is now dead. Yeah, Tom. And, yeah, Tom, and thinks about her mother, you know? Like, all those little things kind of bouncing back and forth and they don't realize how interconnected they are. Sure. But it's like... It's like Christian Shepherd said, like fate. It's like when it, you know, whenever fate does anything, it's it's these little connections that have us help each other. And those moments happen. It's just, what does it all mean? Did fate give Michael the gun? Anna Lucia gave Michael the gun. Fate put Libby there, definitely. Yeah, definitely. Damn because it. we know that everyone around Hurley, Poor Libby. everyone around Hurley, has really bad luck. He's going to blame himself. Sad. Guys, thank you very much for watching this episode of Lost. If you want to see more episode reactions, you can at patreon.com slash blindwave. We're on episode 20 right now. That was this episode. It means that over at Patreon, we're there at the finale. Go check it out.